it is your boy Kenneth Blaze back again with another YouTube video guys and today I'm gonna come to y'all with the new jump shot so these two jump shots are the best jump shots for point guards slash shooting builds and also for builds that can't really shoot that well so these two jump shots honestly anybody can use them and these are the most effective jump shots you can even look on 2k lab these are the best jump shots you're gonna find you're not gonna find any other jump shot better than these two jump shots guaranteed i don't care where you go to i don't care who are you whatever you look for even if you look for it, it's still gonna be these two jump shots right here and um yeah so another thing is i just want to talk about you know how the shooting is in this game obviously the shooting is obviously more easier than the previous 2k21 2k21 actually take some skill to shoot um and obviously like you know center builds really couldn't shoot like that they can shoot but you had to make a build that was able to shoot enough so like a 75 3 or more in order to somewhat shoot consistently you really needed like an 80 to shoot somewhat consistently last year this year you really don't need that so right now i'm gonna start off with the build i'm gonna start off with the uh with the jump shot that everybody wants to know about this is for point guards and for builds that can shoot and if you're a point guard or you're a build that can shoot which is like a, i guess like a 85 yeah 85 86 that's where you get the green percentage that green window this jump shot right here is going to make you shoot way more greens and i'm gonna show you guys what it is and um another thing with this jump shot this jump shot was also for the previous 2k21 as well and it's jump shot 98 and i'm gonna show you guys right here jump shot 98 has been the best jump shot for the past you know two uh two years now and obviously i feel like jump shot 98 might be the next jump shot for the next 2k for some reason this jump shot is by far the best jump shot in 2k and for my release me personally releases don't really affect your jump shot but me personally i use rudy gay because rudy is a very smooth jump shot or a very smooth release i should say and honestly i know some people don't use rudy at, at all but for me i use rudy because you know it's just very smooth and um yeah that's the only reason why i use that type of release in my opinion and with the speed go 100 percent always go 100 percent with your jump shots um it's going to be a little bit different for the second jump shot i'm going to share guys but for the first jump shot since you're a point guard since you're a build that can shoot you shouldn't really have any problems shooting so go 100 percent speed with that all right so now for the second jump shot right if you're a center or you're a lock it's a little bit easier to shoot this year especially if you're in the corner or if you're playing with a guard that can dom you up it's a little bit easier to shoot and if you're noticing that you're missing a couple of shots now the thing about this year is you can really shoot consistently with like a 65 3. if you know your shot you can really shoot consistently this year now this is for this jump shot is for builds that got like a i should say like a 75 3 or lower in my honest opinion so if you got 75 3 or lower or i should say 74 3 or lower use this jump shot right here this is gonna save your butt right here i'm not gonna lie to y'all guys this jump shot is a miracle and it's steph curry steph curry is the jump shot right here i'm gonna show you guys right here steph curry is the jump shot that y'all need to have now the reason why i say steph curry and another jump shot too is also uh i believe it was jump shot nine no jump shot 36 and those another sh jump shot too i think it was dante exum or something like that but for a fact steph curry is the best jump shot for non-shooting builds it doesn't even come close it doesn't even come close no set shots no other jump shots come close to this shot right here honestly if you're a lock and you're sitting in the corner or if you're a center build and you're sometimes in the corner you're gonna green 100 now another thing that you can do is you can obviously like you don't have to make 100 speed but if you can you can do that but me honestly i'll probably put it like a one take down so like a 65 speed or something like that but if it feels too slow for you you can put up to 100 speed or if you feel like you mastered the jump shot you can put up to 100 speed and if you're playing with the with the point guard with dimer you're not missing with this shot trust me you're not missing with the shot it's not gonna happen <laughs> and 
for me, I know some of y'all guys are saying like, I have no reason to talk. I'm a stretch. I, I should be able to shoot consistently, which is true. I should be able to shoot consistently. But um, at first I didn't have jump shot 98. I'm not gonna lie to y'all guys. I had a whole completely different jump shot and I noticed that I was breaking. So once I put jump shot 98 and also put on the right badges, I was greening. Now, make sure with the Steph Curry also, put I didn't even talk about it I also put Rudy Gay because it's a smooth release but I'm not gonna lie to you guys jump um badges really do matter especially if you have a low three but since this year it's a little bit easier um you know you it, you can pretty much kind of you know fluctuate with your badges so it's your boy Keenness Blaze make sure to like comment subscribe more videos on the way and yeah I'm out guys peace